So we want to do 10.3 number 31 first. Um, All right, so I've got the cube root of 9v times the cube root of negative 3v squared, and I want to <coughs> simplify. Okay, so how do I do this? Oh, they're both under a cube root, right? So I can say, all right, this is the cube root of 9v times negative 3 times v squared. Okay, now what do you do? Okay, there's a cube root. I combine the v's and the numbers, right? Using multiplication. So what do I get? Negative 27v cubed. Okay, and I know how to do actually all of this, right? Yeah, so is it 3 or negative 3? Negative 3? Yes. Because it's cubed, right? It's an odd power, so there's no worries about the plus or minus. I know whether it was positive or negative. In this case, to get a negative out of a 3, I needed negative to start with. So I got negative 3 v. Do I have to worry about plus or minuses or absolute value dealies? No. The directions say not to, but I also don't have to worry because it's cubing. Odd powers play nice with plus and minuses. Cool? All right. So there's that guy. 